Hello. Today we are looking at how to install IMVU on a Chromebook. Please take note that you need a Chromebook with an Intel or AMD processor for this tutorial to work. Firstly, we will enable two settings on our Chromebook to increase the performance of the game. To do this we will go to these pages and enable the settings. The links are in the video description. Now we will reboot our Chromebook. Now we will enable Linux apps on our device. To do this we will go to our system settings and click on the advanced section on the left panel. Now we click on the developer section. Now we will turn on the Linux apps. Now that we have enabled Linux apps on our system, we will continue to the next part of the installation process, which is to run several commands in a terminal that will install Wine. Wine is an application that allows us to install some Windows applications on a Chromebook. All the commands are in the video description. Now we will copy the first command and open a terminal session from our app menu. Next, we will paste the command into our terminal, either with a two-finger click on your terminal or click Ctrl, Shift and V together. This command will enable 32-bit architecture for Wine on your system. Now we will download the Wine security key. Now we will add the security key to our system. Now we will be pasting the next two commands into our terminal. This will add the wine repositories to our system. Now we will add another security key that Wine requires. Now we will update the system repositories of our Linux apps. Now we will install Wine. Press Enter to confirm the installation. Wine is now installed. Now we need to install three additional packages which Wine requires.
Click on Install to confirm the installation. Click on Install to confirm the installation. Click on Install to confirm the installation. Now we will continue to the next step, and that is to install IMBU we will download it with the next command. Now we will install IMVU. To launch the game we need to run the last command every time in a terminal. However, we need to modify it first by taking the username of our Linux apps and replace it with username in the command. Let's do it now. Let's run the command. Enjoy!